Witchcraft. 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 This girl must be practicing witchcraft. Witchcraft. Okay. I thought this was an interesting story from theweek.in. It's an Indian outlet. And the headline here is Astrologer Dr. Sohini Sastri enters hallowed pages of World Book of Records. First of all, I didn't know there was a World Book of Records. It's a separate thing from uh, Guinness Book of World Records. Uh, but mm. let's learn a little bit about this here. The best astrologer in India, Dr. Sohini Sastri, was honored by World Book of Records for outstanding contribution in the fields of astrology, palmistry, vastu shastra, color therapy, uh, rudraksha therapy, gemology, or, uh, <laughs> gemology, like gems, and other spiritual sciences with promoting the cause of humanity. The program mm. was graced by Wilhelm Jesler, Chairman Udu International, Switzerland, among other dignitaries. Dr. Sohini Sestri's entry to the World Book of Records London is indeed a major boost to the field of astrology and occult science. She was recently inducted following the footsteps of world luminaries as Narendra Modi, Angela Merkel, Bill Gates... Ratan what? Tata, I don't know who that is. Kapil Dev, maybe some some Indian people. Uh, Mark Zuckerberg, Hillary Clinton, Late Lata Mangeshkar, Sheikh Hasina, and many more. World Book of Records is a hub of like-minded progressive people based in United Kingdom and India with the primary objective to recognize, list, and honor people and places that have achieved and established certain unparalleled feats in the pages of history. It provides international certification to all these exemplary achievements. It is spread across UK, Switzerland, Australia, US, and India. Dr. Sohini Sastri is regarded as India's top astrologer, being the only one from India to have been felicit felicitated Huh? Felicitated. F facilitated? I thought that's what the word is, but it says felicitated. Hmm. Oh, okay. With the Gandhi Nobel Prize, uh, Gandhi Nobel Peace Award in 2020, she has the inner strength and wisdom to overcome problems, and she did it to attain greatness at an early age. She was include, inclined to spirituality from an early age, belonging to the family of Swami Dharma. Megaranya, Megar, Meg, Megaranya, from the paternal side, while from her mother's side, she belongs to the family of Swami Hari Harananda Aranya. Although she was, in, I'm sorry, I'm totally butchering these names, but Indian names are hard. Although she was inclined to, uh, to academics and completed her post graduation in political science. She never intended to be a professional astrologer, but she was encouraged towards the occult sciences by her family's spiritual guru. She completed her doctorate in astrology from Victoria Global University and a D-Lit from National American University. She's a specialist in Krishnamurti Padati. Isn't Krishnamurti, wasn't he the guy that claimed to be Christ? I could be wrong about that. Um, I think he might have been know. one of the Indian gurus that... Claimed to be the second command of Christ. I could be wrong. Sure. Which is a well, blend that's of, a good, it'd be a good reason to put him in the book of records. Yeah, Krishnamurti Padati, which is a blend of Western astrology and Vedic astrology. Dr. Sastri excels in numerology, gemology, color therapy. We already read this. And Tantra. Uh, she has a long list of celebrities and VVIP. I think this is supposed to be VIPs, but mm -hmm. foreign... You know, it's a W. VIPs from Bollywood, sports persons, <laughs> sports, sports persons. persons, politicians who swear by her astrological predictions and adversaries. Okay, well, so then it goes on to more about what she knows about Vedic astrology and all kinds of Veda, karma, all that kind of stuff. But I, of two things. One, very interesting to highlight, you know, the world. Can you imagine? somebody giving an award like an institution a, a, an international type of institution giving an award to like the greatest occultist of america <laughs> it seems, you know it's just kind of weird but also if you think about it with india it's part of their culture so it's less weird i think for you know india but yeah uh, world book of records london okay yeah 
You know, it's really interesting. I've been doing some searching here uh-huh. while you've been reading about that. You search World Book of Records, you, and you, the you first... get Guinness, you get a wave of Guinness. Yes. Yeah, that's right. I already did the this. The first thing is uh, yeah, the f- search result <laughs> is Guinness Book of Records. You're freaking me out, Gons. The uh, second <laughs> one is the World Book of Records. Yeah, World it's got Book the of star Records with stuff. a little s- swipe through it or something, the logo. Uh, UK, yes. And I have uh, just been poking around. I did find the Apply Now oh, hey. uh, thing, so we can definitely get try to get in there and apply. There's some interesting eligibility criteria. There is... One of the eligibility criteria is participant should be a resident Indian, NRI or PIO. Mm. I don't know what NRI or PIO means, but uh, a resident Indian. I mean, you have to live in India or maybe live somewhere else, but also be Indian. What does that mean to you? I, I don't know. I have to look at the language to really... Well, I'm, yeah, I'm reading it to you. We I, need I to know, search, know, but search just, these uh, terms here. Uh, N-R-I or P-I-O. So that's already weird. Doesn't seem like J- Mark Zuckerberg would uh, hit that criteria. I'm th- wondering if this is a pay-to-play Book of World Records type of thing. And possibly, they just give yeah. they just give the award to a bunch of famous people to kind of give it, so you know, give it an official... give it credence, give them something to connect with or talk about. It would be like us like, uh, tapping into what is it called? The thing where the celebrities cameo and having them do like a thing and being like, oh, look at look at this. Dustin Hoffman loves Canary Cry. Like, yeah, right. Something like that. Yeah. Um, okay, PIO is Persons of Indian Origin. Ah, okay. And NRI is non-resident indian weird so you just have to be indian mm-hmm. to even be eligible for this interesting and somehow bill gates and mark zuckerberg <laughs> and yeah because they're indian is, you didn't know this I, I did not know this <laughs> apparently <laughs> all lizard these people lizard people hey, what, are, what if that's the crazy deception ooh, you know where these elite maybe, to India, they appear as Indian, and then to uh-huh. like China, they're you know oh. appearing as Chinese. Oh, that was just that is another yet. level. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah. I'm thinking this is some sort of pay to play thing. It seems like they're trying to, you know, put off the impression of like a Guinness Book of World yeah. Records. I'm looking at these can... uh, these buttons. What's the difference between World Book of Records and World Record Book? Yeah, there are two different things on this website. Okay. I don't know what they are. World Record Book Limited UK is a publishing initiative of World Book of Records, leveraging world rights throughout the worldwide and local (laughs) teams position to publish, market, and publicize our World Records book in both physical and ebook formats. Apart from its core categories, World Records Book Company is committed to publish books in general, including religion, spiritualities. Oh, they're just publishing books in general, including religion, spirituality, science, history, biography, and memoir, business, self improvement, books for book, book for kids, technology, <laughs> one book, one book healing, for kids, it's personal not the Bible. Personal growth, the environment, and social change. Apart from this, at WRBL, authors and their work are center everything we do, et cetera, et cetera. Da, 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 yeah. This is just, yeah, this is some sort of scam. <laughs> I mean, this is like a, a mix between, I mean, the fact that they're trying to put off this impression that they are like a, you know, a book of world thing, records yeah. thing. It's kind of a cover. It's kind of a cover for, A, just a for-profit publishing company. Uh, and B, when that has very specific sort of, uh, you know, new agey, uh, maybe just spirituality, self-help, personal growth, health and healing, to, you know, that milieu. Um, Man, I'm looking at their executive members page here, and uh, this whole thing looks fake. Yeah. Like, if you were going to deep fake some faces and throw it onto a list of alleged executive members... Uh-huh. This is it right here. I mean, this is like look. Yeah, there's a guy is... in here that's got like Indian police, and he's got an Indian police garb hat. Doesn't I don't know, man. It doesn't. This doesn't look real. <laughs> well, it is. It's you know what? It, it's just an. It's an Indian company that is. I guess has a very specific 
very, very specific way of doing business uh, to get a, you know, honor the people they want to honor or whatever. I think that this is a pay to play thing. I think if we go through this application, we'll be contacted and asked what sort of uh, donation we could make to the organization or how many books we could sell, something like that. Right. I don't know. This is all just uh, very strange. But okay, what, what, uh, we, we should, uh, I want to look at the, there's an a official certificate directory so we could see who's gotten the certificate. Okay, Let's let look up here. Mark Zuckerberg. Official Zuckerberg. certificate directory. Got it. Yeah. Oh, you can Zuck. look up names. Okay. You can look up names. Look up Bill Gates. I'm going to look okay, up Mark Zuckerberg. I'll do Bill Gates. Or William Gates, perhaps. Uh, no Bill uh. Gates. Maybe just Gates. No Gates. No um, Gates. Yeah, no records found for Mark Zuckerberg. Who else? Hillary Clinton? <laughs> was she on the list? She was on the list. No Hillary okay. Clinton. What, what, where are they getting this information? The week? I'm, I'm telling you, this is, uh, this is Angela a Merkel? Angela Merkel's on there. Following the... Okay, so let me read this again. Okay. She was recently inducted following the footsteps of world luminaries such as Angela Merkel, Bill Gates. Yeah. I don't... Yeah. (laughs) What are you talking about, man? It's a lie. (laughs) None of these people are in here. (laughs) Maybe they're part of the world record club. Maybe, Maybe they're... A different level. They're not these low, lowly certificate owners. They are uh, perhaps yes. They they, are, they're they're in the the star the, edition, the diamond or level. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Okay. Anyway. Well, that's fun. So we'll keep an eye out for that, and maybe uh, well, let's apply. Let's see what they have to say for themselves. I mean, we're we're in the business of spirituality and religion and mm-hmm. uh, self help <laughs> and yeah different form but stuff like that i mean the value for value is essentially self-help in a way in a way yeah 